Hi, I'm Norm Stillman from the Court Street Animal Hospital in Plymouth here for this week's PCN Pet Health segment. Uh, this week I thought I'd talk with you about Lyme disease, uh, a timely subject this time of the year. Uh, Lyme disease is probably the most common infectious disease that we see in the spring and also in the autumn. Uh, it's carried by ticks and cats are mostly immune to it, but dogs very commonly get it. Uh, I want to tell you about the four typical symptoms of Lyme disease so that you can recognize it in your own dog. Uh, typically, a dog with Lyme disease has almost a, an overnight onset. Uh, it's never slow to come on, but always comes on very quickly. Dogs who have Lyme disease typically develop a sudden onset of joint pain or lameness, also a low-grade fever, also some lethargy, and almost always decreased appetite. So very typically, I'll see a dog who comes in, uh, the dog was fine yesterday and today she wouldn't finish her breakfast and uh, also she's carrying one of her legs or sometimes just very lethargic and normally she jumps right in the truck but today she needed some help in. Uh, those would be very typical presentations for Lyme disease. The good news about Lyme disease is that it's very uh, easy to treat and to diagnose. The, the diagnosis is very straightforward in almost every case and the treatment is a very safe and easily obtained and inexpensive medication. Uh, typically, we, we say that dogs who are treated for Lyme disease are cured of it. There's not really a, um, a chronic state or a residual state like they say there is in humans. So recognizing the disease and getting it treated uh, in a timely manner is, is typically uh, all you need to do. The interesting thing about Lyme disease is that you can get it again and again if you're a dog. It's not like chicken pox. Uh, once you have it and you're treated, you're still susceptible to it in the future if you're a dog. So. Uh, I hope that helps you to recognize Lyme disease uh, this time of the year and, and get it treated if your dog is unfortunate enough to contract it. Uh, thanks so much for watching. It's, uh, it's been a pleasure seeing you this week.